Peter Pan, that's what they call me I promise that you'll never be lonely Peter Pan, that's what they call me 2020 was a great year, am I right? <laughs> I was being, I was being sarcastic. Calm down, calm down, Karens. Um, yeah, I just want to talk about this year. Thank you guys for supporting me so much this year. I came so far. I think at the beginning of this year, I was at like 20 something subscribers. Now I'm at like 130 something. So that means the world to me. I grew over a hundred, so at least 110 subs. So around there over the past year. So I just want to thank you all. Thank you guys so much. And I can't wait to see where I am next year. <clears throat> and this is not only, um, a special day for this video, but it's also a special day because recently today I hit a hundred followers on my Maddie Cartwheel Instagram. So if you haven't checked that out, I recommend following it because I post a lot about interesting things about my life and sometimes I post polls that will be in future videos what decides what I do. So make sure to check that out. It's Maddie underscore cartwheel, no capital spaces whatsoever. <laughs> I kind of messed that up. Maddie, is, Maddie underscore cartwheel, no capitals or spaces whatsoever. I said that more clear now. So this video is a New Year's video. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys for supporting me so much. Let's get into the video. This is going to mostly be memorable and mostly be me talking. So if you enjoy those videos, this is the video to watch. Also, I can't tell you guys how much this means to me of you guys supporting me throughout the year. So I appreciate it. I love you guys so much. Let's get into the actual freaking video. Let's breathe one last air of 2020. That, that did not sound right at all. Here, let me rephrase that. Let's breathe, let's breathe one last breath of 2020. How about that? 2020, well, I miss you. Oh, I did that wrong. I did that wrong. I'm gonna miss you, but not really. Another, another thing I want to say is that I hope 2021 is better than 2020. 2020 costs a lot of horny experiences. Like, um, you know, the virus, you know, give us new tool tactics to, like, fight past other things that are similar to this to get things, you know. <laughs> it gives us survival skills for when another thing happens like this again. God forbid, God forbid, but, um, you know, 2020 also taught us, you know, to be brave and, uh, you know, no matter what, to appreciate the little things, you know. So 2020 did teach us a few things. And also, I just want to say that, well, I've, I've accomplished a lot this year. Um, I get to get my license in 2021 because that's when the DMV opens back up. So maybe that's the first thing of 2020 or 2021. And I'll make it better than 2020. Maybe 2021 is already going to be better. Uh, I got two cavities in 2020. Yeah, that's not anything to brag about. It's just, I, I take really good care of my teeth, except I don't brush them very well. Um, you know, uh, I hit 100 subscribers, so that was a bonus. Um, yeah, a, a lot of things... I, I have accomplished this year. I, I don't really have words for 2020. Um, I guess I learned who my true friends were this year. Now, I'm not, I don't have like a boyfriend or whatever, but that's, that shouldn't matter. It should matter that, you know, towards the end of this year, we learn stuff. And throughout the year, of course. And I just want to say, uh, New Year's resolutions. Um, one thing we can do better is thinking about posting better content, not stressing myself about posting um, trying to find better friends, um, I'm gonna give at least two more, um, being kinder, being less selfish, which that kind of goes with being kind, and, um, doing more for you guys, um, I feel like, I feel like I already do enough for you guys, but maybe I can do a little bit more, hopefully, I don't know, I feel like that might be a little too much on me, but I am doing the best I can, so thank you guys so much, um, and this, this isn't in the video, I'm, this is film. this is being filmed, like, on the 21st of December, so I'm probably gonna, um, uh, add more to it on New Year's, so if this, if this comes out, like, a little bit after New Year's, I'm sorry, um, so yeah, like, honestly, <laughs> I wanna make, I wanna make this a good video for you guys, I don't wanna make it, like, a brush video, you know, and yeah, not being filmed on New Year's, because New Year's is big, I'll make it, like, a party type video, uh, got our house decorated for Christmas. I know I already probably showed you in a video, but we kind of got a little stuff back there. I don't know if I get copyrighted for this, but, um, there's a little Christmas frog, so let's press this foot and see what happens. Come on, you worked earlier. There you go. Yeah, this is at my grandma's, actually. I love this frog. It's the only thing nice we have at Christmas. So. 
Should I make a dramatic hair flip? Uh, yeah. There's that. Um, we got some things up on this little tiny mantle. Uh, painted that in fourth grade, but we still keep it as decoration. Do you guys keep things of when you were little on the, you know, in your house? <laughs> and you're like 15 or whatever, or no matter how old you are. Pretty sure you do. We already got some stocking stuffers in there, in our stockings. And then we got our tree up with presents under it. We already got presents. We already know Santa ain't real. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but I don't get why people lie about Santa. That's another thing. Why do you lie to your kids about a guy who's not even real? Same thing with the Easter Bunny and Tooth Fairy. Like, I hate, many creators hate, avoid saying this stuff because, you know, they want to, like, offend any younger viewers watching. But, like, why make up some people who aren't real? I'm not telling my kids that. I'm just going to say, you know, got you guys gifts, you know. And they say they only do that, like, to bring joy, and I get that. But think about a creepy old man that goes down your chimney, gives you guys gifts, and then eats your cookies. We're slowly killing Santa, but he's also a mini pedophile. He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows when you've been bad or good. So be good for goodness sake. I mean, damn. It's kind of creepy. I'll see you guys later when I add on to this New Year's video. I hope you guys have a great Christmas and great New Year. I've been filming ahead of time. Like, many of my videos in January... So far, um, yeah, that are gonna be that are set private, that are gonna be public. Uh, I made really early, like in December. Also, I just want to say some videos I set private that um, are gonna be set public don't um, give you notifications for when I upload. So check the channel for videos for when I upload because they won't show up unless it's a premiere or I regularly upload it. So uh, yeah. Anyway, I just want to give that little message. I will see you guys on actual New Year's. Also, I'm, I know I said to you guys on New Year's, but I had to add something. I did receive my wish jacket. Now, I think that was just a lucky chance because I hoped and hoped for it and prayed and prayed for it. So, yeah, all I have to receive now is the bracelets, which I paid 10 bucks for them. If they don't come in, like, that's okay because it's only 10 bucks. But my mom's like, 10 bucks is not you paid for it. But still, the jacket was like 30 something. I'm just never ordering from them again just to be safe because it came a week and a day after it was supposed to come in. So, I want to update you guys about the wish jacket. I was talking about it in my other video. So, if you want to risk it, I guess which is the place to go, but yeah. Also, like I've been through all with experiences. I'm sorry if I didn't know what to say in the last clips. It's just 2020 is very confusing. It's kind of hard to think of things on the spot, and especially you know with this year being so like bad. You know, I don't know how to say it. You know, which is like <laughs> my sister is just. Oh, I told her to be quiet because I was trying to film a clip. A clip. Ah, I don't even know what I'm saying. Today's just a messed up for messed up day for words. Um. But yeah, I just can't wait for 2021, but that doesn't mean that everything's going to go away from 2020 and 2021. It could still lead up into 2021. You never know. But I'm talking too much. I just want to say thank you guys for everything you've done for me. I've been through a lot of experiences this year. Um, I got my first fan, you know, t-shirt this year at the beginning. If you haven't, um, if you haven't seen that and stuck around for this long, then you might want to go back and watch the older videos and see that. And I thought that was pretty cool. I've received a lot of support. Uh, I've two fans made fan pages about me and then deleted them or I found out they're creepy or some sort of scammer so that happened a lot of things happened and it's just kind of hard to explain it on one video but anyway for now I will see you on New Year's I don't think I'm going to add anything to it anytime soon unless something interesting happens see you guys on New Year's this video will probably come out a day or two after New Year's I have no idea when it will come out I'll try to get it out on New Year's but yeah see you guys Yo, what's up, everybody? It's Maddie Cartwheel back with another video, and in this video, uh, it's New Year's. I'm not gonna film like the whole thing about what we're doing or whatever, but I just thought I'd show you our little setup up here. Um, I was gonna film every little thing we did, but I feel like that'd be a lot of work, and I'm too lazy to do that. I just want to enjoy my New Year's without um, filming. So I hope you guys have a great New Year's Eve and a great New Year's as well. It's New Year's Eve right now. Um, I hope 2020 is great for you guys. It may this video might come out. Uh, on New Year's Day or later that night on New Year's Eve. I'm sorry if it doesn't come out on a Thursday, but hopefully it ends up working out. <laughs> um, but you'll definitely get the video on one of those days, New Year's Eve or New Year's Day. Um, I thought about filming everything we did, but I'm like, I went to my New Year's Eve without filming, you know, because it's stressful sometimes. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for all the joy and laughter you brought to me this year. I love you guys so much. And I'll show you our little setup and everything we have. You hear my family, they're playing game downstairs. Then I play Uno with them, but anyway. I got the railing. We decorated that. We decorated this little section. You can have a little table. 
We brought our table from downstairs up here. We got some kid wine. <laughs> my sister's still not old enough to drink. She's 18, so she still has three years. Here's my water. Love it. Excuse me, I'm not sick. It's just kind of dusty and musty up here. Went in my cat and hat, and we got popped a little mic in my karaoke later. We got Nerf guns. Bop it, bringing back the 2000s old decade. I should have did this last year, but I went with my friend Carter at her little New Year's Eve party. Um, but that would have been great to end the decade off with a bunch of nostalgia stuff. But it's okay, we're doing it this year. We got Hoverball. I don't know if you guys heard of this. This is kind of a 2000s toy. Uh, early 2000s toy. It's very fun. It's great to do on the floor. Let me show you guys an example. So, it's pretty cool. They're playing in Yahtzee. I didn't want to play, so. <laughs> but I did end up playing with them. I am a good child. Um, we got Skippo, we got Reverse Rage, Dark Mania, Headbands, Focus, Operation, Hangman, and of course Jenga. I know what my phone's doing there. Got my little hangout area. And yeah, this is messy. We're going to clean this off though. My sister has her lights here. So yeah, we're just going to party. It's going to be awesome. My drone I haven't touched. Like to tomorrow will be a year exactly, New Year's Day, since I've touched my drone. I should make a video of my drone, but it's very cheap, so it breaks the um, wings, which are these, break off easy. So yeah. I also have every, almost every drone because if I don't have it, I've read it. It's just been at the library. So yeah. I have the new one, but it's downstairs. So yeah, I'll bring it up here sometime later. I hope that you guys certainly enjoyed this video. This is the last video of the year, maybe the first video of the year. Whatever it happens to be, it'll be great. I don't like BTS or K-pop, just my sister who's kind of like her room. Um, I love you guys. Have a great New Year's or New Year's Eve in both. Um, and yeah, hopefully 2021 is much better than 2020. A lot's happened this year, so thank you guys for making me hit all the mini milestones and goals and being there for me, not just YouTube. Oh, you know, like I said in the beginning of this video, 2020 has taught us to appreciate the little things. Anyway, oh, I don't know if I showed you this. It's not much, but we decorate this as well. It's the chimney from leaning downstairs. I love you guys. Have a great day. And... Yeah, I don't know what else to say. Remember to look both ways for a year across the street. Remember, everyone deserves a smile. Bye, guys.